Congratulations, old friend. You really are going places in Valhalla. Where's Mimir? I'm not supposed to be here! Polkari oh, Shaito! We talk about that image of you in the shrine we keep seeing. If Valhalla keeps pulling it out of your head, it must have some significance to you. Could it be that the idea of being loved and respected is a fair might better than the alternative? Now hear me out, and it's not as though I'm the smartest man alive or anything, but don't you think joining Freya's council could put you in a position to walk that path? To earn that path? Well, that would be a poor reason to accept. Ambition is poison.
going back to that image of you on the shrine. I'll grant you ambition can be a poisonous motive, but your ambitions are only to help people, not for your own glory, right? Make the world a better, safer place. I think maybe that image of you is symbolic of your desire to walk a righteous path. Valhalla's little signpost. You are sure accepting Freya's offer is the right thing for me? Or for the realms? I think we are here to make sure about that. One way or the other. Come <laughs> on. 
Challengers like it to find. That is how we earn our way forward. Good. The route to the higher area ought to be open now. I wouldn't say no to some short time help.
Congratulations, old friend. You really are going places in Valhalla. Where is Mimir? Is that really all you have to say to me? After all this time, can't muster up so much as hello for one of your most auspicious victims? Hello, Helios. Where is Mimir? How should I know? Why don't we go look for him? Hmm? So, what's new with you, Kratos? Murdered any good pantheons lately? Devastated any populations with the cataclysmic consequences of your actions? Turned on any once trusted allies? You simply must bring me up to speed on your latest saga of blood-soaked vengeance. I am that no longer. You don't mean to say you've gone soft. Never believe it. Once a Spartan, always a Spartan. No, there's no fooling me, Kratos. You know what they say? You can't hide in the shadows from a sun god. At least, that's what they should say. Looking a little more familiar, isn't it? A mighty chain. Auspicious sign. You've always had such luck with chains. This is all gonna work out just great for you. I can feel it. Oh, there it is. Home sweet home. This room must really take you back. Wasn't this the Chamber of Sacrifice? Where you let an Athenian soldier burn to a crisp, just so you could get past the roof? Oh, those madcap early days. How you must miss them. <laughs> what are you doing, Kratos? Sacrifice me? Again? you'll need to push me along to get in. Oh, good. You're making eye contact as you push me towards my demise. What a special little personal touch. Really lets me know where I stand. Especially after such a long and agonized deliberation over what to do. Oh, how reluctant you tell people you were to sacrifice me to the flame. <laughs>
hate to disappoint you, you blithering idiot. But you do remember I'm a sun god, right? You think I'm afraid of a little fire? Don't threaten me with a good time, Kratos. Maybe I'll be infused with power and achieve my final form. Maybe I'll explode and take you with me. Let's just see what happens. Let's just see. For another push. Let's go. Okay, seriously, Kratos, get me out of this cage. It's not funny anymore. I can't believe you mean to roast me on a whim, on a presumption that it's what Valhalla wants from you. Have you ever considered that maybe your instincts are just random thoughts that pop into your head, no more likely to be true than the next? Hmm? Maybe consider that. Quickly! going to incinerate me and see what happens? I swear, you haven't changed one solitary... Brother? What am I doing in here? Over here. Over here. What's that? No. No! Get me out of here. Brother. What is this? Help me! I'm trying! Do not panic. We will simply return to the gate. I don't think so. I think you've broken how Valhalla works. Oh, I think this is it, brother. Thing. Look at you. You shouldn't have done that. Oh, heal, dummy. You and Kratos would not. But you're safe now. Sigrun, I'm sorry. I've been so foolish. I... Later, love. <laughs> I need a moment. As I will be forever in yours. <clears throat> My lady! Stop. You've seen me worse. I'm not sure about that, boss. Hush. It's not the air can't be. <coughs> this could take some time. Oh. 
Well, that was altogether bloody terrifying. One moment I'm in a forest, the next I'm in a cage full of fire. You changed into Helios and back again. It was unpredictable. I'll say. I'm truly not sure if we've gone too far, or if we've come too far to stop. We are not stopping. I must face this. I know, brother. We did more things and more things to do. Check. Aha! Another of those spots for bargaining with Valhalla. Better yourself if and when you can, I always say. Memory of your past made manifest. Hmm. A dangerous memory. Memory of Vanaheim now. Brother, I beg you not to remember the exploding plants. What did you say about a forest? You remember being elsewhere when Helios took your place? Aye. Yes, I didn't mention that while we were plummeting, but yes, I was in a forest, much like that of my youth. Back on my old body, too. 
It was a bit dreamlike, to be honest. Hmm. Do you wish to return there? I can't say I don't. I'm concerned, but I'm more than curious. Guess my memories are fair game in here as well. Don't suppose they'll just stick to the pleasant ones, will they? Unlikely.